Hey, Matt here. Wanted to talk about my Scrapebox helper tools. While these tools were in development, Scrapebox has had some changes. So let's talk about uh, these tools in Scrapebox and how it all works together. So the first tool um, is what I like to call the high speed duplicate remover. It offers three basic features. One is remove duplicate domains. The second is or the first is remove duplicate URLs, the second is remove duplicate domains and trim them to root, and the third is to remove actual root domains. So if I wanted to remove duplicate URLs, this tool will do up to about 50 million lines or so, so it could load up, you know, about, about 50 files that were a million uh, lines each. Um, this will actually just remove duplicate URLs. The algorithm used for this will vary slightly from scrape boxes, so you're going to be a few URLs different. I didn't think it was a big deal on the millions of URLs to be a few different um, overall. On the remove duplicate domains option, it removes duplicate domains, but it also trims them to root. So if your web page is you know site.com forward slash page one it's going to get rid of the page one part it just trims it to site.com so unless you really want to trim URLs to root this really isn't going to be a feature that you're going to use um, but we stuck it in there because it was easy and it just due to the way this tool is coded it can't leave the full URL intact and still get the job done quickly uh, the remove root domains feature is nice if you have um, just like site.com in your list it'll take that out it's only going to leave pages that have that are you know further pages down in the list so um, jumping in here we would browse and add files to remove duplicate URLs so if I wanted to add these five files now you have to click each one um, due to the tool the way it's made again it doesn't let us multi select so we just have to click each one and then we're going to choose that and we can remove each one one by one here and we hit start and it asks you to specify an output file so we click OK and then we can just name it whatever we want I'm gonna call it test one hit start and it's you can see it going to town here it's about four and a half million URLs here um, Scrapebox has a new add-on that also removes duplicate URLs it lets you merge files together so I would merge all these five files together and then I would remove duplicate URLs from them. Now Scrapebox's tool can actually handle up to about 180 million lines. Um, I did a quick test on this four and a half million. Um, Scrapebox took about 90 seconds to get the whole job done, took about 50 seconds to get the job done with this tool so it was faster to get the job done with this tool and you can see there we are it's finished but um, having to individually select lines it would depend on how many you're doing. If you were messing with 180 files of a million each, you'd probably want to use Scrapebox, obviously. If you're messing with 5, 10 million, this is probably actually going to be faster. Um, so now if I wanted to go, say, take that file, that test one file we just did, and actually remove the root domains, I can do that, hit start, specify my output file, I'm just going to pick another file, and it's actually going to go through and chop off the root domains. And what that is really is if you have a, a file that looks like this, it's going to take that out. It's only going to leave files in there that look like this. So you're, you're not, obviously the root site of a page is not going to be commentable. So um, it's going to take that out for you. And the job is finished. So that's the first tool.